History is packed with overlooked figures, and Alice Ball is one of the most tragic. This woman revolutionized leprosy treatment, but died before she could witness the impact of her brilliance. Her stolen legacy is a reminder of unsung women in science. And in this video, we will unravel the secrets behind this extraordinary chemist's work in life. Early Years and Education Alice Augusta Ball was born on July 24, 1892, in Seattle, Washington. From a young age, Alice showed a remarkable aptitude for academics, displaying a keen interest in science and chemistry. Encouraged by her parents, she pursued her passion for learning, excelling in her studies, and demonstrating a natural talent for scientific inquiry. In 1910, Alice enrolled at the University of Washington, where she pursued a degree in pharmaceutical chemistry, a field that would become her lifelong passion. Under the guidance of renowned chemist William Fisk Whitney, she thrived in her studies, immersing herself in the principles of chemistry and pharmaceutical science, trailblazing at the University of Hawaii. Following her graduation from the University of Washington in 1912, Alice Ball set her sights on furthering her education and scientific pursuits. In 1914, she made the bold decision to relocate to Hawaii to attend the College of Hawaii, where she enrolled in the master's program in chemistry. Despite facing racial and gender discrimination, Alice persevered, becoming the first woman and the first African-American to graduate with a master's degree in chemistry from the University of Hawaii in 1915. Her groundbreaking achievements shattered barriers and paved the way for future generations of women and minority scientists. Alice Ball's Research on Leprosy During her time at the University of Hawaii, Alice Ball became deeply immersed in the local community and was confronted with the devastating impact of leprosy, also known as Hansen's disease. Leprosy was a highly stigmatized and misunderstood disease at the time, often associated with social ostracism and isolation. Witnessing the suffering and marginalization of those afflicted by leprosy ignited a passionate desire within Alice to find a solution. Alice embarked on an extensive research journey, driven by a relentless pursuit of knowledge and a deep sense of compassion for the individuals affected by the disease. She meticulously studied the existing treatments for leprosy, which at the time were largely ineffective and often caused debilitating side effects. Recognizing the urgent need for a more viable treatment option, Alice set out to explore alternative approaches. Central to Alice's research was the study of Chalmugra oil, an ancient remedy derived from the seeds of the Chalmugra tree which had long been used in traditional medicine for the treatment of leprosy. Despite its historical use, Chalmugra oil posed significant challenges in its administration, as it was difficult to absorb and often caused discomfort to patients when administered orally or topically. Undeterred by these obstacles, Alice Ball approached her research with a rigorous scientific methodology, conducting experiments to better understand the chemical composition of Chalmugra oil and its potential therapeutic properties. Through painstaking experimentation, Alice made significant strides in isolating the active compounds within the oil and exploring methods to enhance its efficacy and tolerability. The Ball Method Through meticulous experimentation and scientific inquiry, Alice Ball succeeded in isolating the active compound in Cholmugra oil and developing a novel technique for its extraction and purification. Known as the Ball Method, her revolutionary approach involved esterifying the fatty acids in the oil, making it more soluble and thus more readily absorbed by the body. The development of the Ball method represented a significant milestone in the field of medicine, offering new hope to individuals afflicted by leprosy and challenging the prevailing notions of incurability surrounding the disease. Alice's groundbreaking research not only provided a tangible solution to a pressing medical problem, but also demonstrated the transformative power of scientific innovation and compassion in alleviating human suffering. Her tragic end. Despite her remarkable achievements and groundbreaking contributions to the field of medicine, Alice Ball's life was tragically cut short at a young age. In 1916, at the age of just 24, Alice's promising career and bright future were abruptly halted by her untimely death. The exact circumstances surrounding her passing remain unclear, 
as historical records offer conflicting accounts, but it is widely believed that she succumbed to illness or accidental poisoning. Alice's sudden and premature death came as a profound shock to her colleagues, friends, and the scientific community at large. Her passing robbed the world of a brilliant mind and an extraordinary talent, leaving behind a sense of loss and mourning among those who knew her and admired her work. Alice's groundbreaking research on the treatment of leprosy, culminating in the development of the Ball Method, revolutionized the approach to leprosy treatment and saved countless lives around the world. Her innovative techniques and pioneering spirit paved the way for future advancements in pharmacology and drug development, leaving an indelible mark on the field of medicine. Legacy Today, Alice Ball's enduring legacy serves as a source of inspiration and motivation for aspiring scientists and researchers around the world. Her story reminds us of the transformative power of perseverance, intellect, and innovation in the face of adversity, and her pioneering spirit continues to inspire future generations to pursue their passions and make a difference in the world.